There's the lineup on the left of your shot, and it features uh, some of the big names. Certainly two of them in the form of Casta Semenya and uh, Genezeb Dibaba. Jenny Meadows has the job of uh, pacing this race. She said uh, they've been asked uh, for 57 seconds. She said she thought 55. Semenya wouldn't have the 55 first lap that uh, was requested by Dibaba. There's your Olympic champion, double Olympic champion, double world champion. And uh, runs very much more of an even, even pace race. There's a former world champion in, in, in uh, Eunice Sum of Kenya. And there's Dibaba, world record holder at the 1500 meters in Monaco a couple of uh, seasons ago. She's had one race over 800 meters this season as Dibaba. 2-0-0-62. Wambui, tall figure. Another Kenyan bronze medalist in the Olympic Games. His first outing of the season. Then you've got... Uh, Jovic of uh, Poland, European Championship bronze medal a couple of seasons ago. She was fifth in the Olympic final. And then uh, Charlene Lipsy of the United States drawn right on the inside. Her indoor best, incidentally, is better than her outdoor best, so she's obviously improving well. So they're looking for 57 for the first lap, and then we'll see how De Barber... Well, De Barber wanted the faster first lap, but she's not got it. So Menya said no. <coughs> See when they get into the back straight uh, what sort of lineup we've got. Certainly some men you look so comfortable in there, and Dibaba just sitting towards the well, towards the back of that field. She has the speed endurance, the strength endurance, that's for sure. Chatting to Jenny earlier on today, she said, yeah, I'm pleased they're after 57, not 55, but they, you can see there the reticence of Wambui and Semenya to go with the pace, so it's going to be Dibaba who's trying to slot in, and you can understand that, 1,500 meter runner, or maybe a 5,000, 10,000 runner these days, wants it good and hard from the start, pointless uh, her trying to trade sprints, if you like. On the other hand, Dibaba has run 157 at the end of a 1,500, so I'm really looking forward to this. Jenny Meadows is about a five meter lead now, but the others are starting to gather behind but Semenya sitting right off this. Well, the barber's there, Wambu is there, and uh, Ghoul of Jamaica already up there as well. So Semenya's got the work to do, but remember how quick she is over the last 200 meters. The barber there in third place in the race proper. And Ghoul has done very well. She's got an all times a national champion, but she's going to find it tough now. Look at Semenya. How easy does Semenya look? Dibaba, Semenya, Semenya goes past Wambui, Dibaba in third place now, and then Sun, the former world champion behind her, and Semenya looks absolutely majestic, so comfortable, as they go with about 120, 130 to go now, Wambui putting the pedal down in the final stage, and Dibaba looking for speed, it's not coming now, and Semenya absolutely flies. Total dominance, Wambui in second place. Some looks to me as though she's going to come through into third, but look at these first two. Semenya wins it, Wambui in second place, some in third place, and that was two, I think it was just over, what was it, 150? I'm just looking at the time there, Steve. Did we catch the time? I think it's, uh, let's just check it out. One, uh, 156, 61. It looked quick, it was quick. I'm not going to say it's a world lead because it's, it's too early in the season. It's the fastest we've seen by a long way. It's a meeting record. It's very classy, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, by anyone's standards, that's a good run uh, by Semenya's. Yeah, we're getting used to this now. She's been in great form already coming out of the South African season. So look at that there, the form there, not tying up at all. Wambui doing her best. And to be honest, the others behind her, you, you looked at Dibaba there. That's about as bad as you're ever going to see her look in the, the last 50 meters of a race all over the place finding out what real 800 meter running is about it's always interesting to me i don't think let's have a look at that the barber's only just dipped under two minutes and yeah 157 at the end of the 1500 meter final last year and then can't get uh, much under two minutes here so nowhere near semenya out on her own will lead and if she keeps running like that for the rest of the season which i suspect she will you can't see anybody really getting past her can you